Hey Kim students, this tutorial is going to focus on moles and volume. So as we go through these, we're going to remember that at STP or standard temperature and pressure. So standard temperature being 273 Kelvin, standard pressure being one atmosphere. One mole of a gas will occupy a volume of 22.4 liters. And I do want to point out that this is found on the back of your reference page right in the middle under constant. So molar volume at STP is equal to 22.4 liters per mole or what we have written 22.4 liters per one mole. Alright so we're going to go through two types of problems. The first one we're going to convert moles to volume, so moles to liters, and the second one we're going to go from liters to the number of mole. So let's go get started. Number one, determine the volume of 2.5 mole of chlorine gas. Alright, so I need to go ahead and start with what I know, or what I'm given, so I'm given 2.5 mole of chlorine. I'm going to set up for a conversion factor and I want volume in the end. So volume is going to be expressed in liters. So if I have 2.5 mole of chlorine, how many liters of chlorine do I have? Alright, now I'm going to plug in my conversion factor, making sure I solve for what I want, that that part needs to be on top. So if I want to solve for liters, I need to put this half on top. So 22.4 liters, remember this means is equal to one mole. Another reason why I put mole on the bottom is so that my units will cancel. Now it's just a calculator problem. So 2.5 times 22.4, so 2.5 times 22.4. All right, and I have 56 liters of chlorine gas. All right, number two. Determine the mole of 112 liters of hydrogen gas. So always write down what you're given. So 112 liters of H2. Now remember, for hydrogen and chlorine, they're part of what we just called Brinkelhoff. That's why they have the two. We're not using it in this problem, but we're leaving it there. All right, the setup for a conversion factor. And I'm going to write what I'm asked to solve for, so determine the mole. So I'm asked to determine it, it means I don't know it yet. So mole of H2, hydrogen. All right, now I'm going to figure out how do I plug in this conversion factor to solve for what I want. If I want mole in the end, I need to place that half of my conversion factor on top and put the other half on the bottom because when I do my liters cancel out and that's good because I didn't want to solve for liters anyway. Alright now I'm going to multiply everything across the top so 112 times 1 is 112 then I'm going to divide by everything on the bottom so 112 divided by 22.4 and I get 5 mole. Alright, so try a couple of these on your own. Come back to this video as needed. And as always, ask me questions.